On this week's boiler tip, we're going to talk about types of pilots. Um, there are three primary groups of pilots like we have here. One being a standing pilot, which we're illustrating in this example. An intermittent pilot and an interrupted pilot. So we're going to take a look at each and the applications for them. If we have an atmospheric unit, we'll often have a standing pilot and the pilot will stay lit at all times using a flame detection uh, system to verify that it's lit and when we get a call for heat the main fuel will simply be energized. There's our main fuel. A little bit anemic there but we get the point. So when the call for heat is satisfied the main fuel valve will shut off and the pilot will remain on. So this is typical for an atmospheric unit, perhaps, that doesn't have a fan that has to start and stop. The second type of pilot is an interrupted pilot. So on our light off sequence, we'll get spark, we'll get pilot, and then we'll get main. And then once that's proven, our spark and pilot will extinguish. So we're proving the main flame on its own. So that's an interrupted pilot. The third type pilot is an intermittent pilot. And intermittent means that the pilot's lit the entire time that the main flame is, but not the spark. So let's look at that. So this is frequently used on a very small burner. Um, over a certain size, we'll never use an intermittent um, pilot. But when our call for heat ends, both the main and pilot fuel valves will be de-energized. 